How's Gordon getting on with the extra special good as gold superstar strike scheme? Very well indeed. In fact, he's moved on to the third level already and should be on to the fourth one by Friday. Really? Oh, yes. Well, that's uh, very nice for him. Yeah, he's very happy about it. He said Peter's doing well too. Oh, yes. Uh, maybe not quite that well, but well, yes. Gordon's on the third level already and should be on the fourth by Friday. I have no idea what you're talking about. Neither have I. I mean, I knew about the extra special good as gold superstar stripe scheme, but I didn't know it had levels. Don't worry. This is Peter we're talking about. Oh, hello, Martin. Come on in. Now, I've written out the recipe for tea tonight. Martin, can you hear me? Right. Well, it's all written down for you. <sighs> you might like to put the potatoes on now. I'll be down in a minute. I've just got to brush my hair and tidy myself up a bit. <sighs> I'll go and put my feet up then, shall I? That's not funny. All right, sorry. You can look for my mobile phone if you want to be helpful. Yes, dear. There you are, Henry. Martin's arrived at last and we're leaving in a minute. Where are you off to now? It's your parents' evening, in case you'd forgotten. Oh, yes, I had forgotten. Anything you want to tell us before we go, Henry? <laughs> nope, don't think so. Good. Well, I've left instructions in the kitchen for Martin to make your tea, and now if you'll excuse me... I was wondering if we could get a takeaway tonight. No. I mean, I'll understand if you say no, but it would be a nice treat. I said no, Henry. Seeing as how you're having a nice evening out without us. N-O spells no, Henry, and that's that. <laughs> no! Can we just go home again, pretend we've been in? We can't do that. Maybe we can just see Miss Lovely and then go home again? Come on. Let's get it over with. <sighs> evening, Henry's mum and dad. Oh, uh, good evening, Al's dad. Hello there. I don't know. What are you thinking? Oh, I was just thinking how funny it is that parents are so like their children. Yes, I was thinking that too. You're not thinking? No. No one could possibly think we're like Henry. Ah, they're here. They're here, Miss Hotbud. Yes, thank you, Sidmouth. My PTA, Parent Tracker Alarm, told me that. Uh, very good, Miss Hotbud. Uh, anything you'd like me to do? Just keep an eye on them and make sure there's no horrid business tonight. Very good, Miss Oddwood. At your service. Hey, attention! I'm sure the sign said this way. Maybe we should ask someone. No one in there. Maybe we should go back, retrace our steps. Like Hansel and Gretel. Oh, very funny. No one in there either. Unless you count the evil goldfish. Oh, we're going to be late. Even later than we already are. It's OK. I recognise that pot plant. Really? That's because we walked past it five minutes ago. We really should ask someone. There isn't anyone to ask. Maybe there's someone in there. Hello? It's locked. Well, why did you come in here in the first place? Well, why did you follow me? If you were still outside, you'd be able to let me out. But I'm not, so go figure. <sighs> there must be another way out of here. Hello, Martin. I said, hello, Martin. It's tea time. It's a good thing Peter can cook. I can't 
get a signal. Oh, why don't these things work when you want them to? It's not turned on. Oh, stupid thing. Why isn't it turned on? Not that one. Maybe this is it. Oh, so that's how you turn it on. Can't see a light switch anywhere. There's one here. Oh! Thanks. Hmm? Oh, that's all right. What do you mean you can't come and help get tea ready? I mean I can't come and help get tea ready. Well, that's nice, isn't it? So you're leaving me to do it? Yes. All on my own? Yes. And you're expecting me to do it because you're doing something else? Yes. Which is way more important than helping me get tea ready. Yes. Right. Well, I suppose I'll go and get tea ready then, shall I? Yes. And am I right in thinking you don't want any tea, Worm? Yes. I, I mean, no. And don't call me Worm. All right, then. I'm going now to make tea. This is me going to make tea. Now! Oh, Henry, just go and make the tea, will you? All right, all right. No need to be so grumpy. No tea for me tonight, I reckon. Let's hope we can find a side entrance. I don't want to go in the main entrance with you looking like that. It's not my fault. Well, it's not mine either. Ah, we can go in here. Oh, I can use the torch on my phone. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, sorry, forgot to charge it. There must be light somewhere near the door. Ah. Oh, careful. Oh, careful. I found them. I'm going to make tea now, all right? Honestly, babysitters nowadays. Even rabid Rebecca used to make tea. Oh, mind you, I was never quite sure what was in her Halloween hot pot. Peel the potatoes, cook the potatoes, mash the potatoes, peel the carrots, cook the carrots, mash the carrots. Peter likes them mashed. Hm, well, that's not happening. Peel the beans, cook the beans, don't mash the beans. Peter doesn't like his beans mashed. What if I liked my beans mashed? Yeah, not likely. Peel the chicken, cook the chicken, mash the chicken. Oh, I'm going to be cooking all night at this rate. I don't know how mums do it. No potatoes, I ask you. Don't worry, you look lovely. I'm sure no one will notice. Oh, look, Miss Oddbod's office. We've been here before. Let's see if there's anyone in here who can help us. Easy, Tiddles, easy. Like child, like parent, eh, Tiddles? You'd think they'd know better. Hello? Anyone there? Grateful that you came to find us, Mr. Soggington. We were completely lost. Yeah, it was just us and the evil goldfish. That's my Goldilocks you're talking about. Oh, I'm most terribly sorry. I, I didn't realise. I, uh, sorry. Good. Can't believe you laid the table too. Martin! Honestly, teenagers. I blame it on their mobile phones. 
Mmm, this smells yummy, Henry. No! Please, Henry, can I have some more? No! Hello, did you have a nice evening? Oh. <laughs> oh, hello, Martin. Come on in. Peter! Henry! Martin's here! You going out again? Oh, don't be horrid, Henry. You know we've got Peter's teacher talk tonight. Oh, I can't wait for you to hear about all the good as gold stars I've got. Neither can I, honey bun. Your dad and I are very proud of you. Yeah, because it's really hard to be good as gold all the time. Actually, it is, Henry. Much harder than you think. Harder than being horrid all the time, I should think. I'm not horrid all the time, am I? Anyway, what's for tea? Peter's cooking. Cos we can always get a takeaway, you know, save you cooking. What did you say? I said Peter's cooking. Peter's cooking? Cooking what? Bye, boys. House hot pot. No! Why, thank you, kind sir. A pleasure, my lady. Oh, you. Good evening to you. Oh, hello. Good evening to you, too. Let's do this. With pleasure, my lady. Greetings, both. Oh, greetings to you, too. Oh dear, I'm getting flashbacks. It's okay. Just remember, tonight we're Peter's parents, not Henry's. Yes, of course. Shall we? <laughs> welcome, welcome to our happy place where happy children learn happy things. Now, if I could just ask you to collect your timetables from Miss Lovely over there, and then we can get started. The trick to a really good house hot pot is to give it all a really good stir. The trick to a really good house hot pot is not to make it in the first place. And when you've done that, you can add a little bit of magic water to make it really light and fluffy. What's magic water when it's at home? It's water that has magic in it. So, it's just water then? No, it's water that has magic in it. <sighs> Why don't Mum and Dad ever have anything to eat in the fridge? Right about now, Miss Lovely will be asking Mum and Dad if they've been as good as gold. And have you been as good as gold? Of course, Miss Lovely. There you go, then. That's your good as gold timetable for this evening. Oh, how sweet. Did Peter make this? He did. Isn't it lovely? Yes, Miss Lovely. It's really lovely. Lovely is as lovely does, I always say. Uh, yes. Off you go now. Time to have your teacher talk. And right about now, they'll be sitting down to talk to Madame Tutu about my dancing. Alors, Henri. Um, do you mean Peter, Madame Tutu? No, I mean Henri. Oh, uh, right, because we're here to talk about... Henri! That's right. Henri le Terrible. Well, usually we call him Horrid, but... Horrid, Terrible, Awful. Who cares? Ha, yes. Who cares? We need to talk about Henri. All right, then, if you insist. What's he done now, Madame Tutu? Poof! What has he not done? He has used my dance studio as a football pitch. He has tied all the ballet shoes together to make a long rope. 
I didn't know he could tie shoelaces already. Then he used the long rope to tie up all the girls. Um... And? Oh, no. And he put them all back again afterwards. <sighs> but that's a good thing, isn't it? In the wrong box. Oh, well then. Goodness me, is that the time? I think our five minutes must be up. That Henri, he really is horrible. Actually, horrid is the word you're looking for. Henry is horrid, most of the time. Ah, uh, yes. Henri d'Henri. This is a perfect name for him. You don't say. To make a really good household pot, you have to have patience and skill. And a lot of vegetables. <laughs> that was a little joke. Do you think it worked? Right about now, Mum and Dad should be on their way to see Miss Lovely. <laughs> <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, uh, sorry. Didn't see you there. Can I help you? Uh, we're here to talk about... Oh, yes, Henry. Well, no, uh... Henry, Henry, Henry. What can we say about a boy called Henry? Well, you could probably say a lot, but... Oh, yes, the time we turned the ceiling blue. What? But then that was probably my fault, trying to make a cup of coffee at the same time. Mr, um... Walter. But you can call me Wheelie Walter. All right, Mr, um, Wheelie Walter. Do you actually teach Peter? Peter? Who's Peter? Uh, will you excuse us, Mr. Wheelie Walter? Is he even on the timetable? No, he's not. Then why do we go to see him? <coughs> ah, Mr. Soggington. We didn't see you there. Uh, do sit down. Here. Yeah, you look familiar. Have I seen you somewhere before? Yes. No. I thought so. I'm really, really sorry about what I said about your goldfish, uh, Goldilocks. Oh, don't you worry about that. She's forgotten all about it. Three-second memory, you see. Uh, uh, who did you say you are again? We're Peter's parents. Mm, nope, not one of mine. Well, we'll be off then. No, Henry, though. It was only the once, mind. Once was enough, mind. It was one of them music lessons, you know. The ones where everyone plays an instrument. When he said he played the flute, my little heart soared. Only it turned out he didn't play the flute, that is. Well, thank you, Mr Sockington. Uh, we'll keep that in mind. Hello, Peter's mum and dad. I've been waiting for you. Mum and Dad are probably talking to Miss Lovely because there's so much she'll want to tell them. All about my good as gold stars and my turn on the story carpet and my wonderfully wise windows on the world project. And another thing about Henry is that we can never, ever get him to do his homework. Ah, well, you see... And Peter does his sometimes twice over just for the fun of it. Ah, yes, well, you see, Peter... But will Henry do his homework? No, he won't. No, he won't. He'll sit and do a gross class zero puzzle till the cows come home. You see, we don't mind Peter doing the number gnomes doubly difficult giant jigsaw... Because that's educational. And gross class zero isn't. All that farting and snot and... Yes, well, we don't want to bother Miss Lovely with all that. Well, it's been lovely to see you both. Oh, uh, yes, thank you, Miss Lovely. Goodbye, Peter's mum and dad. Don't worry, we'll uh, see ourselves out. Oh, you can't leave without trying our delicious school food. Oh, no, of course. Oh, mm, it's um, quite um, interesting. We're very proud of our stew, made fresh every week by our very own executive chief head chef. Marvellous! Yuck! Looks like school stew! 
It's the same recipe. Yes! I knew Mum kept a spare packet somewhere. We're home. How was your evening? Oh, well... Did you like my wonderfully wise windows on the world? Oh, yes, it was uh, wonderfully wise. And my turn on the story carpet? Oh, yes, sweetie bun. It was very... Turnful. I've made us a wonderful supper. Hmm, what is it, Peter? It's stew! 